Yo! What up, y'all? Welcome back to another one. Ah, driving down the road. Got the camper hooked on on the way back from the lake. Got to thinking here, and it's Monday, man. I need to get up a video. Um, I've, been, I've been behind, been spending a lot of family time at the lake, been busy booking clients. So I want to say thank you to everybody for the interest. Uh, wanting to come here to Kansas this coming season and hunt with me here at my lodge, Sand Hill Flyway. So thank you guys, uh, got a lot of you guys booked. Just wanna tell you, very limited spots available. And I mean limited, guys. It's getting tight, it's good. It's a good problem to have. So if you are interested still for the 22-23 fall season, down below in the description is the Sand Hill link. Go down there, click it, fill out the inquire to book form. I will be getting a hold of you. Second off before we go here, uh, you guys gotta drop a comment down below and let me know, should I should I do early season honker hunting in North Dakota? It's coming up, it opens the 15th, I believe, and I know a lot of you want me to go. I go every single year. I've just been uh, thinking to take a little more time off this year and, and not travel as much, but I got the itch. The weather's looking decent. It's not gonna be scorching hot like last year. Drop a comment. Would you guys enjoy those videos? And just be honest, please. But without further ado, uh, these two or three silenced guns are my buddy Mike's. Uh, he brought them for a couple hunts, a duck hunt, a goose hunt, and a pigeon hunt. So I figured I'd just take all the footage from those, kind of wrap them together, hunt, 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 because they're awesome. These silenced shotguns were amazing to shoot, a lot of fun. And you guys enjoyed them, so we're gonna do a little recap. Enjoy the hunt. We got Mike here. Mike's been on how many hunts with us? Two or three? Yeah. Uh, this is probably the third video that we're using a silencer. Uh, Mike, real quickly, is going to go over the entire rig that he has here and the one that he's personally shooting. Uh, Preston will be wielding this. I'll be wielding it. I got Fred too, so we're just going to kind of pass it around. But take it away, Mike, and tell him what it is. All right. So this is an escort. This is actually an escort Magnum Supreme left-handed shotgun. I bought this kind of as a budget build. I've done a few odds and ends things to it. There's a review on my YouTube channel at Realm Arms. Um, this is the Silencer Co. Suppressor. This is in the full configuration of all 12 inches. It has all the baffles in it. You can actually take down, take the baffles out of it to make it shorter if you want to. But on this one, I'm going to leave it the long one. Normally it's on this 12 gauge bullpup. And I've had a lot of people ask me what the pattern is on it. Like I said, there's a YouTube channel, um, a video we did to show, this, uh, to show how it works with this. And it actually does pattern pretty good. Uh, the shorter bullpup gun has the 18 and a half inch barrel on it, so with that on there, it actually adds pretty good. You know, it's, it's a pretty short gun, you can see compared to this one. So, anyway, we'll uh, we'll test it out today and shoot it and see how it works. Uh, so everybody's gonna ask about the magazine. All right. So, so this is it is a mag-fed gun. It is plugged. You can only put two in there and then one in the chamber, just like you could with this. That's plugged as well. Um, it does have an EOTech red dot on it um, to hunt with. But yeah, so there's only gonna be, I have one magazine to carry with me at all times, and there's only gonna be two rounds in the mag and then one in there, just like you would a normal firearm. See the back yeah. of the blinds? Should yeah. we replace, get pull them Canada's out and go white on the back? Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah. See yeah. that black wall? We got some time. Okay, let's do it. Well, look today. Me and Drew. Big spread. Preston on the right. And Big old Frederick. Bodies. Old Frederick's in his dog barn. We got full bodies all over you, buddy. I'm sorry. You're going to have to watch out today and not nail him down here. But this is uh, the view from the lay down blind. Uh, gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. And you, sir, are wielding the bad boy. Yep. Holy smokes. Old uh, Preston's going to be rocking the stick with, uh, with the GoPro on his head, baby. I'm excited. Yeah. But we want to tell you guys, uh, man, if you haven't checked out Preston and I, it's not just mine, but our podcast, we have all the guides on there every single night. We have special guests every single, almost every single uh, podcast episode where we have clients in, or, well, the last episode, Federal Ammunition. Yeah. Uh, we got to ask them all about uh, the ammo shortage and what they're trying to do to uh, fix it and get ammo out to people but we like to uh say what we want to over there and discuss things that i can't talk about here and we're giving away hunts over there everything uh it's 
a lot of good information. So if you guys like learning stuff and getting our tips from these videos, you ought to go subscribe to the yeah. podcast. It's always linked in the description. Yeah, and the one we did with Mike. Mike, what episode did we do with you? Um, uh, Whatever it is, it know. was really good. Yeah, we, it was uh, real good. Mike makes a really cool AR. We have 30 episodes up now, 31. Mm-hmm. Yep. So we're cranking out every single week. Uh, at least one goes up, so on a Sunday, and so it's perfect. <laughs> Shoot him over the top! Rick! Rick! I gotta be quicker. Dude, this thing's hard to... Hey, three low right, 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 right here. Good shot. This thing's so quiet. Dude, is it? <laughs> Hold on, let me see. If... Yep, you're filming. Good deal. Good, Fred. Here. I got you. Hey, you, I don't right. think you picked that up. What? I can, you didn't pick it. Yeah. All right. In the yeah, area. Dude, that safety messes me up so bad. Did we shoot the single? Shoot the single snow. Stop, stop, stop. stop. <laughs> shoot him up top. So I lost my right contact, oh, no. my dominant eye. So this shooting's probably gonna be pretty bad. You hit it, I think. <laughs> well, I don't know. Do it the single over the top. Okay, okay, that's good. <laughs> Shoot that bird on the in front. That's it. That's good. Shoot the snows above you! Okay! That was a little double tap. Uh, I, I hit the hook. Did you get all fixed up? Yeah. Yeah, I can shoot. Lost your dominant eye contact? I leave contact? both eyes open, yeah. but just, you can't even see what you're looking at. Right. It's weird. Thank God you had some in your truck, I though. Know. That's a good idea. Put them in your blind bag. Extra contact. I just didn't bring it today because we didn't. I didn't want a bunch of stuff in the field. Yep. But yeah. Uh, it's sitting right at nine, nine o'clock. Uh, not going too bad. Not going too bad. Got a lot of specks on the ground. A couple snows. Heck yeah. The lessers. I don't know what happened to this roost, but there is not even half of the birds that got off of it. And I mean that. There was a bunch yesterday. Shoot it up front! There you go! What did? Oh, really? You gonna shoot it? Yeah. We're gonna see what it sounds like. The guys wanna hear it. Go ahead and let her rip. That sounds so cool. <laughs> it's like you can hear the action so much more. Yeah, that is sweet. What a beauty! Shoot your shoot that one. This one. Yep. Look at that beauty. Oh my God! That was not quiet. <laughs> that was not quiet at all. But that's what we got going today. We put the old panel blind under a solo evergreen and it looks awesome i was just looking back at it <laughs> uh from the decoy spread and uh it looks good what do you got going on down here dog we shoot a 12 gauge bull pup with the suppressor on it <laughs> <laughs> nothing's nothing too fancy. yeah nothing, nothing special something different. nothing too different than usual put the 10 round mags 10 round mag on a bull pup with a suppressor now y'all have seen this gun before since then you got it cerakoted yeah and it's a left hand gun. Show them where it ejects. So it ejects back here. So basically for left handed people, you can shoot it 
You can't really yeah. shoot a right handed with the left handed version because they're really jacked in their face. But yep. other than that, it's. Last year, I shot that gun and about took my lip off because I'm right handed. But luckily, you brought the normal shotgun yep, too that you can throw one. it on. Yep, I'll put the suppressor on down here a little bit. Uh huh. The old suppressor. Uh, we did a duck hunting video with Mike. By the way, big shout out to Mike for bringing the suppressor today. We're all going to pass it around. Uh, Y'all met Mike when was that December? Uh, yeah, probably. December. Probably December. Sometime in December. We did a pond hunt. I see mallard duck hunt. Oh, that was that good one. That was the out east mallard hunt. I remember that one. Mm -hmm. We smashed them that day. We shot 40 some ducks. Oh, yeah, here comes old single. All right, Mike, you're going to take the first shot. We'll back you up. Shoot him. Oh, got oh. him on the lap. You hit him. Yeah, I'll walk him out. Ready? One, two, three. Shoot him. Drop that boy. I think we did pretty good there. We did. You let her just eat right I here. Know I had to. How would you oh, get down? Ready, three, two, one, shoot him. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, <so funny. laughs> Woo, we just dumped well over 10. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Get, ready, get ready, get ready. Get ready, get ready. Load up, load up, load up. I got the beauty. <laughs> right out front, boys. Here's that single. Ready? Oh, no, you're behind me. Oh, they're going to do it real well. Get ready. Maybe. This group here. There's a single. Ready? Shoot them. Oh, those dropped the bottom out of them over here. So the deal is, I got to keep my cheek back because that's scary. Yeah. Oh, yeah that's <laughs> that ejects right there. Did you shoot? Yeah, hell yeah. I don't have a shot cam on it, but man, I'm going to shoot it one time. Listen how quiet it is. Watch out, it's gonna smack you right in the I face. Know. It's gonna go that way. Ready? <laughs> All you hear is You hear more of the action. Than yeah, you hear, you hear way more of this action than you do anything. Those are a lot quieter than the uh, steel loads, the hot steel yeah, loads true. you're shooting out of it. Yep, man, that's sweet. But I probably looked a little awkward shooting it, but I had to keep my face back from the ejection port. All right, you can have her back. That is an absolute stud muffin. Well. I hope you guys enjoyed that. If you have seen that before, yes, I'm not sorry because it's a cool video. But if you haven't, you got to drop a comment down below. Let me know if we should get Mike out here uh, for some more silence pigeon, duck, and goose hunting. Now, yes, I am working on getting my own silencer bot. That's one thing I really want of my own. Uh, they have been out of stock forever. Literally everybody has been out of stock on the Silencer Co. Uh, suppressors because I want one for my Benelli. Uh, I want different threads so I can take it off my Benelli and throw it on my Franke. Um, whatever, you know. I really want to put a silencer on my long tube gun. Okay, I don't think I'll be able to put on the long tube. The short tube gun, probably my Franke, and go snow goose hunting. So silencer tube. I think it'd be sweet. Let me know if you guys think that that would be something you'd want to watch. But like I said, we have very, very limited dates left, guys. Very limited, extreme limited, uh, but enough. So if you're interested, get a hold of me. Fill out the inquire to book form at sandhillflyways.com. It is always linked down below. Thank you all for being here. Uh, the season is almost here. Duff hunting's right around the corner. I have a pigeon hunt planned for y'all. Yep, it's a special one. Subscribe if you haven't, but until next time. Girl, I ain't even getting mad. Cause I've been getting laid back. Baby, you should know that.
I don't need your criticism.